One of the great things we're doing here at St. Vincent College is we've introduced these telepresence devices. One is called a kubi, and a kubi is actually a Japanese word meaning neck, which means that the device can actually form, act, and behave just like you were sitting in the class. You can turn your head and look this way. You can talk directly forward. You can change your direction however you'd like to do. You have all the capability on your own computer while attending class. Another great device we're adding into the, into the classroom is the double. The double robot actually moves around and it actually can go from left to right in the classroom, forward and back, you can present in the class, you can talk and, and actually move closer to your colleagues and peers. These devices have really been revolutionary for us, allowing students to do so much more in the classes that they weren't able to do if they could not attend. So the students have talked very highly about the device. They can see a benefit of it, and at one time one of my students turned around to the whole class and thanked the entire class for allowing them to participate using this device. The education graduate program at St. Vincent College I really feel is unique in this area. We do not just have a traditional program. Our program is contemporary, cutting edge. We try to get as many students that have different needs into our program and be able to meet them. It's small classes. We have fa faculty that work directly with our graduate students. Our students are out in the field if, they're, if their projects lend them to that way. We also have a very strong technology component and as you can tell we have cutting edge technology where we're trying to build students opportunities in our program and actually research those pro practices in happening. St. Vincent College is second to none when it comes to our graduate programs. We have a full program selection, curriculum instruction, special education, counselor education, school administration and leadership, as well as instructional design and technology, which has really kind of crossed all different fields, including training, business, and other areas as well.